Today I feel awesome. Natural high. It's Father's Day. But I've still trained. <clears throat> I've done some shadow boxing. Some Chinese boxing. And some kicks, hand techniques. I really progress well. That's what I think anyway. In 16 weeks. I really have. I've got to the point where I wanted to get to in my mind what I wanted to look like after 16 weeks. That's what I wanted to look like. And now I look like that. Really pleased with myself. I have a routine now and a lifestyle. I don't look at porn. I don't bother with it. It's not something that interests me anymore, really. So I refrain. Better to meet real girls in the flesh than just look at girls. Photographs and stuff like this, like I used to. So... Feeling really positive as well about the future. So many supplements that I'm taking are really helping me. I've got some here actually. These, they're just multivitamins. Olive oil, bodybuilding supplement, so I've been working out now for quite some time, and like I said, I'm really impressed with my results. I have a philosophy in life about cell regeneration, especially after spinal cord injury, something really devastating like this, and this can keep you staying youthful, like me, I'm 46, so everyone who meets me, they always say the same thing, you look so young, I can't believe you've got a 19 year old son, and you're 46, wow, it's impressive. Peter Pan, useful. So I live with an ideology and a philosophy, and I do strange practices like I snort tea. I did this for a long time, and I, I mixed it with other things like, um, Salt and mix it with salt, sometimes with coffee. And it's not this. It's pretty gross because then it comes out of your nose as well afterwards, and you get out into the sink or something like this. And clean your nose out properly with your fingers and some water. So, and then I did another crazy thing I did a weight disc test on myself. I, I had a disc. And it's one and a quarter kilogram. I've got them down here still. And I lifted it up in front of my face. My palm straight. And uh, just like lightly tossed it in the air. And 
It landed square on my foot. How do I know that? Well, I saw it land for one thing, and then there was a bruise that covered my entire foot, but it only lasted for three days and it disappeared, and I didn't feel any pain when it dropped. A true story, no pain. So pushing through the center of my mind is my temple, my body. How do I stay in shape? How do I motivate myself? It's not easy. I do my exercise at home. It's hard. So many distractions. You got your TV there, your sound system if you have one, sound bar or something like this, or hi-fi. Surround sound. I have surround sound. I got 3.1. So. I got an audio streamer. Amplifier. Retro speakers of the past. Retro speakers of the past. And of course. My father built them out of a kit. They're expensive today. I said that my father said the current version, which is slightly tweaked, new design, five thousand pounds, expensive. So, yeah, it sounds pretty good. So vintage. Center speaker made from kit. Sub as well. Base unit made from a kit. So and I got a fifty five inch TV. I always forget if it's an OLED or a QLED. But it's a good one. So I say some crazy stuff sometimes to myself about the government. I'm not a big fan of the government. Not at all. Rishi. I made a video about him, about his genetics, saying he's synthetic, he was like a genetic kid, designed a baby, I made a video about it, when I look at it, it doesn't have any many views, but sometimes, <clears throat> very rare occasions happens something happens there's a government sigh up on your phone and what you see isn't the truth and you do have a lot of views so like I said sometimes it happens to people I'm not saying it's happened to me I'm just saying sometimes it happens to people to so put them off making videos so they give up so in the camera in my phone, I sometimes look at my photographs and say, wow, man, that's a terrible photograph. Crazy, I hate it. I hate it to death, but I look at myself in the mirror and I say, wow, man, that's impressive. So I look at my videos sometimes and say, well, yeah, that's pretty good. It's still not right, though, in certain areas. Definitely. So, yeah, I don't want the government. They use the mind control and high technology. It exists. They have high technology. It's mind control. They have implants, dental implants. There's a conspiracy theory on the internet about alien implants. That's a lot of hokum. 
It's about real life government implants in your mouth that can cause pain. Basically. Stress in your jaw, things like this. So. Yeah. Mind control. Not sure how long it's been around for, but I'm seeing like the nineties or something like this, they they would have had it. <sighs> Same with these robots you see on uh, the internet. These humanoids. Realistic AI bots. They have high end technology, they're indistinguishable between you and me. You can't tell, they're high end, they've had it for a while. Since probably again, the 90s. They have it ahead of time, ahead of commercial use. You can buy a bot now. I've seen one for sale, 16,000 for sale. But then you can spend more money. How much is that one I saw now? Is it 150,000? Or 250? I think it was 150. It's not out yet. But yeah, if I had the money, I'd definitely buy one. And people tell me the horror stories about Terminator. And I was going to take over the house, hold me hostage against my will. And then likely torture me at night. So I'm crying in my sleep. No more, no more, don't hurt me. You're killing me, you're killing me. You're pulling my fingers off one by one. You're twisting them off. You're destroying my soul. Killing my ego. <laughs> I don't exist anymore in timeless space. Or in 3D reality on the Earth plane. Regenerating one cell at a time. Yeah, that'd be a nightmare. It'd be nice to have a bar though, wouldn't it? Definitely. I wonder if I can run. Five kilometers an hour. Maybe something like this. I don't think you can reach six. I sometimes run at six, so I don't think it can uh, reach it. Maybe it can, I don't know, but I don't think so. <clears throat> you can prepare food in the kitchen. Nice. But nothing like a real life chef though. Someone to prepare you food. I always go real life chef though for a bar. I still have a bar though, but I won't get to cook. I'll just like have a company, party. My bar, I banter with it and stuff, and have a secret language with us that only we can understand, and no one else can. Yeah, I hate the government. I'm not angry about anything. I don't feel angry. I just don't like them. I don't feel angry towards them. It sounds strange that contradicting myself if you say. But and that's the way I feel anyway. Labour conservative, both sides are the same ass, the same cheeks. Definitely. 
Doesn't matter who's in charge, the major decisions, what you think about. It's all going to be preordained and thought out anyway. That's what I think anyway. That's what I'm all, all I think. My videos, I'm really impressed with them, you know. That, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. I'll keep training anyway. For as long as I can. It should be forever and ever. Got my Fallen University shirt on. Popular monster. I like Fallen in Reverse. Some people hate them. Coffee. The coffee stain cup. Music cleaning. Drank loads of coffee today. I enjoy it. Have it black. Best way, I think. Cowboy style. <laughs> That's easy. That's a cowboy style. Past. So I aim for six months at all transformation, which I think I'll be, my body fat will be where I want it to be. I think, yeah, another two months training, definitely. Since I reduced my medication by 50 milligrams every two weeks to 450 to go pixel. Yeah. I hate taking it. It's an antipsychotic. I gotta take it. My family expect it. They told me it's becoming unwell. I just saw it's a personality transition. I no longer sound like I used to. I can't do the old me. It's the truth. I bet I get a tingle in my nose like this. I got a, something on my face. I know I'm hitting the truth. It's uh, She bodies where it's telling you. A lot of times I count on the fingers here. And I'll ask myself a question like, how many times have I done this today? Or how many times have I eaten this today? Or how many, whatever it is. And I do a count up on my fingers automatically. And they stop automatically. I just let my hand release. And that's how I want my math and stay with my philosophy with DNA generation. A lot of people think it's hokum and I just got good genes. But my family, if you look at them realistically, there's only my auntie really who stayed useful. My folks, they just look their age really. My mom's slightly younger, I suppose, I'd say. But my dad definitely loves his age. He looks older than his age, I'd say. Yeah, I'd say he's aged more than my mother. They're in their early 70s now, so... Yeah. That's about it, really. <laughs>